Hello friends, I just wanted to do a quick one here and get you set up with Flux. It's a new model by Black Forest Labs and uh, it's really awesome. I'm really enjoying it. A lot of people are calling it a mid-journey killer. Um, it's feeling that way to me too. Uh, more and more stuff's being unlocked every day. We got control nuts, we got lowers and all that stuff. But yeah, I just wanted to talk really quickly about how to set up the 12 gigabyte VRAM Flux workflow by Inner Reflections. Uh, the link is right there. I'm going to put it up on the thing. The first thing you need to do is download the models. So go to the links in the description below for dev or Schnell, whichever one you want to start with. Remember, Schnell is the four step model and dev is the 25 step model. So dev looks better, takes longer. Schnell is faster and smaller. Doesn't take as long. Grab either one of those uh, the and then put them in the models unit folder in your comfy folder. In order to download the clip stuff, uh, you just go into your manager and go to model manager and type uh, T5. And this is the one you want, the T5XXL. Um, so download that one there. Download that, wait for it to finish, and then go and download the clip L file that's in the description below. That is also going to go in the clip folder. So models clip in your comfy UI folder. The last file you need is the VAE, and that is also available right here on the Flux page. If you just go here and go to VAE, I believe it's this file right here. You can call it whatever you like, um, and it goes in your models VAE folder, and then you just select it in here. So uh, in order to use Schnell, you want to set your steps down here to four, or on the basic scheduler on yours, it'll be you want to set it to four steps, because Schnell works best at four steps. Schnell is uh, basically it's the small model; it's the one that loads really fast. So set your prompt here, and random noise will determine the seed. The cool thing that uh, Inner is doing here, I think, is the split sigmas i don't really understand what's happening but i'm assuming that helps with the the vram load so if you run it um it'll load the model and so now that the the models are loaded uh it should render really fast it's rendering four images right now in 20 seconds 21 seconds pretty sweet and if you want to download dev and try it out, uh, grab the dev model from the same folder, put it in the UNet folder along with Schnell. Uh, they're both 26 gig models, so that's up to you if you want to keep them both on your hard drive all the time. In my experience, dev looks better, but I don't know if it's worth the wait if you don't care that much. So if you just want to have fun and make images, Schnell's great because it's fast. If you want to get serious about it and make really nice looking images, go with dev. Uh, and, you know, in even nicer images, go with pro on the places where pro is available the only thing i added to this setup is the flux guidance node i've heard that if you turn the guidance down a bit from the default 3.5 you get nicer images so i've been trying that out a bit um, all you do there is just route it in through conditioning so add a flux guidance node plug conditioning into it and then conditioning goes through to the basic guider um, and that's uh and then you can control and it's sort of like the cfg all right have fun